Through two games, the Aggie defense has recorded just four sacks. That's tied for 63rd nationally, and it's especially not great when you consider A&M played New Mexico in the opener. Giving Miami quarterback Tyler Van Dyke too much time to throw was costly on Saturday because Hurricanes man Van Dyke torched the Aggies to the tune of over 370 passing yards to go with five touchdowns. Now, sure, the secondary deserves some of the blame, too, giving up deep pass plays and missing numerous open field tackles. But pressure up front always helps the back end. Struggling to get to the quarterback has been a theme under defensive coordinator DJ Dirk in the past two seasons. Out of 131 teams last year, a and was just outside the top 100 in total sacks. So safe to say getting to the quarterback must improve and in a hurry. It can be, I mean, also from schemes and twist games and rush games. And then also but and when young guys transitioning from run to pass, and what I mean on that is you're in a run look and they give you a run look and you realize it's pass, it's transitioning to the edge and getting that rush. That can be fixed and can be done well. That's experience, that's coaching, and them guys' recognition and then getting to that side because we got some guys that can rush the passer and we got some interior guys that can rush the passer. We played the run extremely well, played a great first game. We gave up a couple deep ball passes and we got to get a little more pressure. But DJ's a very good coach. He does a good job and knows what he's doing. The 1-1 one one Aggies need a much better defensive performance on Saturday afternoon against Louisiana Monroe at Kyle Field.